wild turkeys in urban areas. Now, this may sound like an oxymoron, but it is actually becoming more and more common in the Milwaukee area. That's right. And judging by the number of turkey pictures we got from you guys on our Facebook page, you've probably seen one or two. We wanted to find out why there are so many. Here's what we found. We asked and you delivered. Turkey sightings all over the place. Turkey is in our yard. <laughs> you posted these pictures to our Facebook page. Turkeys crossing the road near Marquette on the front walk trying to hitch a ride on a car. There's a turkey and I'm worried about it crossing the street. What do I do about it? The most recent kind of uh, uh, flurry of calls that we had was for a turkey uh, two weeks ago that was in Cathedral Square. And uh, it was actually before that, it was, it was seen running on the freeway. And not only are there more turkeys to be seen in general, wildlife experts say their numbers are especially high at this time of year. The female turkeys laid eggs last summer and raised a lot of poults. And so there really are more turkeys right now than there were six months ago. Funny because I feel like people always think turkeys are more common this time of year because Thanksgiving is coming up, but <laughs> <laughs> they have no idea about it, right? No, no, they're not, they're not more common because Thanksgiving. Turkeys are actually visible year round. They never fly south for the winter, but they do fly. So if you're having trouble seeing one on the ground, just look up. Biologists say they tend to roost in big branches and trees. Students on UWM's campus say they see them all the time. You've seen turkeys around here? Yes. Mm -hmm. Where exactly? Um, right in this area. I've like not seen turkeys up close before, so I was like, okay, this is scary. <laughs> the turkeys were reintroduced in Wisconsin in the 70s by the Department of Natural Resources, and since then, their population has grown and grown and grown. We keep getting more and more turkeys. They've done much better in Wisconsin than we ever expected them to do. So if you do see a turkey and it's causing a problem, you can try and scare it away. They say otherwise, just let it be if it's not bugging anyone. Also, you have to have a permit to shoot and kill a turkey, something that's obviously illegal either way in a city like Milwaukee. So more than just a concealed carry permit? <laughs> like <laughs> yes, a, a exactly. turkey shooting but permit? But there's so many turkeys. There's now two hunting seasons for turkeys. They didn't always used to be in Wisconsin, one in the fall and one in the spring. So. And get out of town. I did not know turkeys could fly. <laughs> they can Come on, be honest. Fly. You didn't know they could fly either. But you knew they had wings, right? right? I, I, I knew they were birds. <laughs> Not any turkeys I've seen. They don't have wings anymore. We want your thoughts on which to topic you'd like to see.